Good morning, Science Castle Explorers. I'm Damon Musselman, your teacher today. Yeah. What happened to her? Um, I'm pretty sure she got yeah. hit by a car. Yeah. <laughs> well, there goes a funny alien, and with them, our vacation plans, said Elvis with tears in his eyes. And we'll be teaching a class on navigation, which is a big fancy word for how do I get where I want to go. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's the tarantula. It's all the, the yeah. And they live here? And this is a legend for the map right here. Seems like my navigational system is broken. It mistook the lake I am swimming in right now for the Science Castle parking lot. We're teaching our class today at uh, the Youth Science Institute here in the beautiful Alum Rock Park in San Jose, California. Very well, sometimes we fly her and she can glide, mm -hmm. but it's not like she can be functional and hunt mm -hmm. in the wild. Oh, and do not forget a map. I have no idea where I am, and I cannot rely on my GPS anymore. Youth Science Institute has been here at Allen Roth Park for the past 55 years. In fact, you can even make your own compass. Yeah, but when it's breeding season, she still gets all flustered and tears up her newspaper. One of the things that the people use to determine north is a compass. And we have three science and nature centers here in the South Bay. Very cool. Oh. Can the hat turn all the way back? Um. Should be a problem finding out where Bruno is, right? If you're ever out in the woods, you can, you can do that trick and you can find where North is. Our focus is hands-on science for children. For example, you can use the magnifying glass that comes with your kit. There's a ghost coming through the dark keyhole. Let's all run and hide. Hey, Thor. Thor. Suddenly, an all too familiar laughter came out of one of the loudspeakers in the wall. <laughs> Stupid Mike and Maxie. How do they do something like that? How do they, how do they take a big, big old lake like this and actually get it onto a small piece of paper and kind of keep the sizes right? We also have a summer camp program that is in full swing. No, her wing is wings. She got hit by a car. Oh. And we have an after school science club to extend children's experiences with hands on science beyond their classroom time. But maybe I can help with that, Bruno, because that's exactly what we're talking about today. But if you get lost, there are several things you can do to help people find you. Um, if you would like more information about YSI, you can go onto our website at youthscience.org. One centimeter on the map is 10,000 centimeters, or one kilometer, in the real world. And then we mark the spot on the string where it ends. Long, long, long for O. Across the room from me, I see another table little smaller. Well, they use a little device called a pantograph, which looks something like this. And you can make one from your, from your science kit. If you look at this little lab star map here, the first star you hit is going to be the North Star, or Polaris. Right now, you are a navigational expert. You can find North, and you'll never, ever be lost. If you have any questions, feel free to ask at sciencecastle.com and uh, we'll be happy to help you get some answers and happy navigating.